Okay, so we can start another program. Let's just say uh, Abby Word that we've been dealing with here. And again, since I've got a window manager running, I can resize the window and I can move it around. Um, so we're starting to have a system that's almost functional. It may look a little bland, but it's it works. Uh, there's a few things you can do. We can start a uh, panel if we want to have a panel down on the bottom or the top, whichever the case may be. And you can again see that our window uh, or that our X term session starting to take a little shape. If I'm sick of looking at this ugly gray background, which I definitely am, I could type X set root hyphen or space hyphen solid, and then just I can type in a color like black to make it solid black. I could type X root space hyphen solid wheat to give it a different color. I'm not particularly fond of that color. So let's go with X set root space hyphen solid quote hash 006060, which is a color that I kind of like. Um, I don't know how well that color comes across on the camera, but at least here in front of me, it looks a lot better. Now, as basic as Evil WM looks, there are a few features available to it. You can maximize a window, um, even though there's no buttons on the top to click on. You can hold down Control Alt and then push X, and that will maximize the window. Push it again, and that will restore the window to its normal size. If you want to uh, restore, or excuse me, if you want to, um, you know, same thing here with this window that I've got in the front now. Can maximize it and unmaximize it. Uh, it's it, people. Some some people that use window managers are kind of diehard keyboard fanatics. They don't really like to use the mouse any more than they have to, and uh, for you know, that's okay for some people, I suppose. Um, there are other things you can do like control all H will actually move the window to the left I'm not even touching the mouse at this point but obviously I can't show that on the camera control all L will move it to the left and the these the H J K L is very it's the same thing as VI if you ever use the VI editor so control alt K will move the window to the up Control alt J will move it down, just like if you're in VI and you press J, 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 you go down. If you press K, 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 you go up. Okay, I've closed out all the programs that I had running, so I'm going to press Control alt backspace to get out of the X window system because, again, evil WM has no way to exit by itself. I'm going to make a uh, small modification to the XNet RC file and then restart the X window system. Okay, I'm ready to go back into the X window system now. I made my modification to the file that I wanted to change. Okay, we're still running Evil WM, but now you can see when it comes up, it looks a little less bland. I'll show you what the XNet RC file looks like. Bring up Abby Word, and let me make the font larger so that you can see. Okay, the first line says X set root space hyphen solid and then my favorite color and again I got the ampersand there on the end to tell that process to to do it and then go away then I say X clock geometry minus zero minus zero which puts it down in the lower right then I say X calc geometry plus zero minus zero which puts that in the lower left and finally X term geometry plus zero plus zero which puts it up here in the upper left uh, which is the default position the last line is evil WM which is the window manager and I, since the window manager is running, I have the ability to move all of these programs around the screen. And that's about all I wanted to show for this time around. Let me uh, demonstrate one thing now. If I press Control alt escape while the mouse is over this window, it shuts it down. If I press Control alt escape while the mouse is over that window, it shuts it down. It's going to ask me if I want to save, and I don't because I don't want to save all that font information. And before I exit, I want to make one more change to the uh, to the Xnet RC just to drive a point home. What we're going to do here is I'm going to put Evil WM above X term, and I have to put an ampersand sign at the end of it. Then I'm going to put X term back down at the bottom, and I'm going to exit out, and I'll come right back in and show you what this does.